they're here. The travel rods are here. The ones that you guys have asked for months and months and months ago, they're finally here. These are the Lunkers TV Edition travel rods. Seven foot two, medium heavy. They come with a travel case. Every single one comes with a sweet succulent travel case with my name and favorite's name on it. Here they are. They're to the Defender Series. I will link them in the very top of the description for you guys if you guys are interested. These are the seven foot two medium heavy uh, casting ones. We have spinning combos as well. I'll link them both down below. They'll say spinning and casting. So if you guys are interested, I know you guys have been waiting for these. I have been waiting for them. All the rods are back in stock. All my Lunkers TV rods finally, finally, finally came in. Thanks for everybody that's been waiting for them. Pretty, pretty excited to get into this. We're gonna be taking, uh, I don't know where he's at, but he's, uh, he's, my, he's my little child. We're gonna be taking Peric out today. I don't know if you guys are new to this channel, any of you guys are new, this is Peric. I, I hang yeah, out with that, him a, a I, ton. I've exploded since the last time I've been here. <laughs> no. Hey guys. <laughs> this is Peric. He's been a while. <laughs> a really good friend of mine. He's part of the little Guggen Squad deal that we have. But he'll be linked down below. He's a, he's a really funny guy. We're gonna be fishing with some of these MTV baits today. We got little jig heads and stuff. We're out here on a creek that I've never fished. I brought the bows and I brought the bass fishing setup to see if we can uh, see if we can link into some fish. I'm pretty excited. I'm always excited to be doing some fishing. See, this is so much more practical. It makes way more sense for you on ponds and doing some creek fishing. I'm telling you right now. You gotta put things in holes. Oh, putting things in holes. I can do everything with a hole. That's why I got a kid. <laughs> I would assume it's not too shallow, huh? Or not too deep, excuse me. It's slippery, I'll tell you what. It's pretty slick, yeah. Okay, so I found like this is actually pretty deep pocket. I just watched a bass come up and chase. So I'm gonna kinda, I'm gonna go put the bow down over here, see if we can catch a bass real quick. Got him. I got a fish. Nope, little tiny one. A little larger though. Look at him digging, look at him digging. Oh, and that's called a quick release. There's a big fish in here, man. I saw him swimming here earlier. I have no clue where he's at now, but me and uh, Peric saw about probably a four pounder swimming somewhere inside of here in this little pocket. I'm still throwing the little, the little uh, shaky head that came in that MTV box. Probably gonna switch over to a stick bait here in a second if we can't get this thing to munch, because he's in here, we just can't see him because of the glare. I'm sure you guys can't see it at all. If we can't. Nope, another little one. Ooh. Yeah, they're all by those bluegills, man. Come on, little dude. Calm down, calm down, calm down. I'm here to help you out. Kind of. There we go. Got another one. Oh, on this shaky head. Do you want to keep walking, though? Oh, little dude. Oh, how clear that water is. There he goes, right over there. All right, so Perk and I are gonna keep moving. We're gonna move down this creek, see if we can find any more pockets like this. This is like a deep pocket. All the current's flowing in too, so we'll probably hit it on the way back in though. And he really, 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 really wants to shoot a fish. Hey, why don't you step on this right there? Oh. Got him. Nope. It's one of the smaller ones. Man, I'm, I'm attracting all the small fish today, huh? I already munched on the stick bait. There we go, there we go. A little large mouth. They can't resist that. Look, dude, look how small he is. Oh, there he goes. I just saw a bunch of buster up here in the front though. That's why I kind of stopped. Yeah, That's probably not the noise you want to hear when we're this far down the river. I'm telling you, they open up those spill gates No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Come on. Dude, you don't want to be down here with those fuel gates open. Dude, I'm telling you, they open if they open up all those spill gates, because we don't know how many they're open. Is that noise right there? Hear that siren? Okay, maybe that's two. That doesn't add up to the amount of spill gates they open. That's just telling you to get the hell out of here. The farther you go, the less current will be. No, I don't think that's the smartest thing to do, young man. I don't know if you guys can hear, but 
the sirens are just going off. And generally when the sirens go off, well actually, no, not generally, when the siren, ooh, see that bass right there? When the sirens go off, this is probably not the area you want to be in. So we have 30 minutes to get out of this creek until they open up the spillway. Because we don't know how many things are going to open up, so better. That was a great cast. I'd rather be safe than sorry. I got another creek we can hit up too. Wow, that was great cast, little buddy. You're a little baby. I don't think I'm a baby. I'm very He's smart. Here you go. You'd be fine. I'm an expert river navigator. Oh my god, I thought 30 minutes. That wasn't no 30 minutes. That was not 30 minutes. Look, as you guys can tell, the water is now flowing in. Well, now this thing's cooking with gas. We got to get out of here. Wow, look at that. Within a matter of minutes, it's coming. Just flowing in. I thought it was 30 minutes. It doesn't look like it's going to take 30 minutes. Now look at it. Now it's a full-fledged flowing river. And what is Peric doing? He's way out there in the middle. What are you doing? I am so glad I didn't get stuck out there in the island. To come across this, look how much that you'd have to swim across. This has turned into seriously a full-fledged river within seconds of them opening up those gates. Look at this. Oh, geez, I'm going to drop my boot. Well, Peric, I'm going to leave this here. Hopefully no one is a thief because I think that's a walkway out right there, hopefully. But Peric says he can't get out and he needs help. So we're going to we're going to go on an adventure together. Oh, right in the I really just hope it doesn't come up anymore. If it comes up anymore, I'm screwed. But I ain't going to leave him down here. I told you, man. I said, "Hey, they're going to open those floodgates. We got to get out of here." Oh yeah, it went quick. I told you it was going to. And now you're just stuck out in the river on an island. Ready? Dude, this is so deep right here. It is flowing like a river. I don't know if this is going to work. You're going to have to swim across. Throw your GoPro at least. Let me give a shot to catch that. I don't think I'm going to catch the rod. It's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, okay, I'm kind of nervous about the GoPro. You're gonna throw the whole mount, okay. I'm ready, kind of nervous. If, if it falls in the water, don't blame me. I'm chucking it way up there. Oh, you're chucking it way up here, okay, all right. Yes! Oh, I got it, I got it, I got the GoPro. Next GoPro. Uh, oh, you're actually throwing the GoPro, okay. Ready? Okay, yeah, <laughs> come on. I'm, I'm keeping that recording. I'm kind of nervous. All right, here we go. <laughs> One, two. Oh, I got it! I got it! Yes. Right. Yeah, I know. Hurry up, let's go. Got him. Okay. I don't know what you're gonna do with the bow. Do you care if it gets wet? No, I don't care if it gets wet. Okay. Don't shoot the arrow at me. I'm gonna shoot it over there. Okay. Okay. I got the arrow. Oh, that's a good idea. Okay, let the bow go. Hold on, hold on. Can you hold? Yeah, hold on. Just, just hold on to the string. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good idea, good idea. Just hold on to the string. It's 200 pound string or 300 pound string. Dude, just come on. Just let go. If, if you start falling, I mean, don't let that wrap around you. Oh my God. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Yeah, it's not good. Dude, come on, hurry up, hurry, 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 Faster, 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 faster. Oh my God, you're getting hard to pull. Oh, I lost my sandal. <laughs> oh, oh, you're going downstream. Come on. Yo. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry about your sandal. Oh my The rod's gone, yeah, I can't do anything about that. All right, just say it. Who was right? Say it. Who was right? You were right. I was right. I told you we had to go. God dang it. You Am I hungry? I just, I seriously can't believe that just happened. Oh my God. Well, here's where we initially walked across in Actually, water keeps getting higher and higher. 
it looks oh my god dude this is like a straight up flowing river jeez all right no one stole my stuff my boots are so full of water still for some reason i got another creek we can go to that doesn't have floodgates i'm not really i'm not really done are you done i oh, know i'm far from done i'm in a great mood oh oh what what is this what what is this sign um i okay yeah that makes sense Oh, you can see why there's no parking behind this point. This was literally the very beginning where we walked all the way across the other side. Absolutely crazy. So the real question is how do you feel after that? Were you traumatized at all? Honestly, I thought I was gonna die. Like, <laughs> it, it wasn't like, it got bad so quickly. The, the sirens went off and then Five minutes later, I was stuck on the island and I thought I was gonna die. Like, if I did not have that thing, like the rope, I could have swept away. Like, I'm so light. It's just, I don't know. I don't know if I should, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> what he should have done was leave whatever I said, hey, the sirens are going off. We gotta go. Hey. But it's all good. I didn't, I, there was no way that Peric was going to be able to swim across that river like that. Cause that thing is gushing. Gushing like a fruit gusher when he squeezes it. I'm no, it's way worse than it's that. It's way worse than that. All right, I'm hungry. You want to get, get a sick off-road sequence here? Oh, <laughs> this is why you drive off a lot. What do you, what do you want? Do you want to I don't know. I'm hungry. We're going to grab some food, and then we're probably going to continue to fish. I got one more creek I want to hit up. I want him to shoot a fish. He hasn't shot one yet. No, I can't, like... We can't I know you stop. Have, I know you have like an appointment at five, but like you're not no, going to go to no. bed unless I shoot one. No, we're going to shoot a fish today. We are not going to give up on that. I know that you almost died and got swept away by a river <laughs> and shot an arrow at me. But we're not giving up. We're not we're, giving up. We're gonna go find a fish to shoot. I busted your jaw. You need to go to the hospital. Here you go. You're good. You have a no. It's fine. You're good. Thank you. Yeah, you have a good day. You got it. You got it. You know how to do it. Thank you. Yep. Well, if the story was fake, it's fine. Okay, well, that's the kind of spot we're in. That was weird, but um, I don't know. I, he said he needed to go to the hospital and needed money, so there's that's all I had on me. If the story wasn't real, it's it's fine, whatever. He needed it more than I did. All right, you ready to go down here? Well, that is one way to start a fishing adventure, I guess. I knew I knew that was kind of down in this area. That I knew there was like a a big bum city or something or just a homeless shelter or something, I don't know. Now I've never done this before, but I've never walked up through there. Uh -huh. I know we can and I know that other side, but oh fish! fish. Oh yeah. There we go. Little creek bass here. Got him on that stick bait. It's not a bad fish, man. It really isn't. He's digging. For being yeah, he's digging. For me for being in these creeks, look at him. It's a pretty good fish, huh? You want to grab him? Oh, Peric with a loop! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> not a bad one. It's not a bad little creek bass right there. Along the wall? Yeah, it was just along that wall right there. There we go. Biggest fish of the day. Moved over here to my sexy, sweet spot. And... Shoop! There he goes, right back into the depths. Fish. Yep. Came right from that same spot. It's another bass. About the same size as that one. Calm down, dude. I'm gonna help you out. All right. He's either been caught before. Or he's got something going on with his mouth. Fish number two from this little spot. There's a big one down here. So like, come down from these trees and go straight on them. Aim right at his belly. Oh, way too high. Way too high. Dang it. There's another one. There's another one. Don't move. Don't move. There's... Oh, dang. Yep, I see him. No, he's still here. Nope, still there. I see him. Nope, yeah, right there. Dang. Just get ready. Dang. Yeah, he's yeah. coming back. Yeah, way too high, dude. Like, when I mean way too high, like, like feet two high. feet too high. Yeah, two foot too high, excuse me. No idea if you hit him, but we're about How to... did I miss that? Yeah, you didn't. You missed him. There's that one right there. Don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. I have a clear shot at that one. Okay. Dude, that one must have just hit a log or something. Oh, there's one right there. That's a bass. 
Is it? Yeah, it's a large mouth. Smoothie King for the third time. I'll go. All right, I'm down. Oh. oh, it was a long day. We walked forever, it felt like. That was crazy though, that, that whole spillage, spillage way, drainage, whatever you want to call that, coming off that damn wall, that water. I told them, I knew, I knew it right when I heard it. But man, that was a long day. We walked far. My feet are like, they look like prunes because they were so wet all day. But it was cool. I got to try to get Peric on his first, his first uh, bowfish, shooting bowfish fish, but he didn't, he didn't hit any. It's all good. It takes a while. I'm telling you guys, bow fishing is not easy. We're off the beginning. Go get it down. Oh, but anyway, make sure to go check these out. These will be linked at the very top. These are my uh, Lunkers TV edition travel rods that come in these, these little socks. They're freaking awesome. Go take a look at them. But that's it. I'm tired. I gotta get out of here. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Then we'll be in a different country. So it might not be tomorrow. Maybe two days from now. I don't know. I got a lot of traveling to do. I love every single one of you. I'm out. I'm out.